So I was having this conversation with this random man on the street. His name is actually Man, and, and, and he, he was telling me, he was telling me after I said my name, of course. I was like, "Well, hello. How how do you do, Man? What is what is your name?" He's like, oh, "That's Man." And I was like, "Oh." And he's like, "What is your name?" And I was like, "Well, it's 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 Rob." And he was like, "Rob a dog flop doesn't have a job." And I was, I was just, I was just, I was just dude, you're you're not you're not a nice person. He, he nodded. He's like, I know, I know, I know. I'm not a nice person. <laughs> okay, we are getting away from that guy. He's, he's, he's feeling infatuated with the fact that I can't get a job, but we're going to show him. So, welcome everybody to episode one of a brand new series. There seems to be a lot of uh, brand new series going on right now, but then again, it is the beginning of the summer, and uh, what is a better time to start out fresh than right now? So, we are here with another star, and obviously, uh, the amount that I play this and the intensity that I play this is all up to you guys. So, if you are excited for this, even though you don't really know what it is yet, uh, I'm going to ask you guys to hit that like button. And the more likes I get, the more I have to do this, and I uh, will continue on this series. But this is something that's been around in Minecraft for a very, very long time. But I'll tell you one thing right now, rob a dob flob is getting a job. And uh, I had to start I had to start playing this uh, with everyone making fun of me, and everyone saying that I couldn't get a job, and I said, you know what? I need to find a job. And someone came to me and said, dude, if you need a job, this is the best place to get one. So that's exactly what we're going to do. Welcome to a wonderful city, a city that you need a job to work in, and Rob Dob Flob is here to stay. So welcome to Eco Survival on the server DesiredCraft.net. You guys may seem that, uh, remember that name. It's actually, uh, where Preston played Prisons for a while. It's a very good server. We really enjoyed it, so I decided to check it out and play some Eco Survival on it, and it has been really cool. I've done some playing around with it, and I think you guys are really going to enjoy the longevity, the intensity, the, uh, the things that you can do in this is pretty freaking cool, um, and I think it fits so perfectly, and I, I can't wait to jump in and, uh, really, really dip on it. So again, if you guys want to want me to continue the series, if you guys want to see more of this, more often of this, make sure to hit that like button. And don't forget to come hang out on the server. Um, there is uh, a decent amount of people on, but I want to see a whole lot of a whole lot of goodness on here, and I think you guys are definitely going to do that. So the IP is in the description. If you want to come hang out. It is pretty cool. So what is Eco Survival? It's been around in Minecraft, I'm pretty sure, for a really, really long time. Um, and I've never actually played it. Just like I never played Factions and I never really played Prisons. And these are things that have been around and people are all really pro at. So I know that there's going to be a majority of the people in the comment section below going, Dude, you need to do this, you need to do that, and I will listen to my best of abilities. But for the people who don't know what Eco Survival is, welcome. Welcome to a village, and the way you progress in the village is you make money. So we got a worker right here. Uh, he does, oh, there he's talking now. Okay, welcome to the job center. You can work here for money. Exactly. So you work, you make money, you use that money to buy things and to level up just like prisons. But the really cool thing is instead of having the intensity of being in a prison um, and being being a naughty, naughty boy, we actually get to take our money and do really cool things like open up shops, buy mansions, rent apartments, have people working for us, get a little town going. Obviously, we're going to have a goodness village going and you guys are all going to be helping out. It is going to be awesome. So but this, at least for now, is the main area. So let's just check out Warp Ranks right here just to give you an idea of what we're looking at. Uh, it's actually not warp ranks. That's not what I want to do. I'm a silly boy. I want to do uh oh sugar slash back. I don't want to be here. I'm scared. Oh, Tommy. Tommy, you're afraid. You're making me afraid. Oh, God. Where am I now? Ah, uh, uh, uh. Oh, no. It's PvP. Oh, my God. I didn't mean to do this. Eat? Oh, God. No. No. No, it was a mistake. It was a mistake. I didn't mean. I didn't know where I was. I thought this would take me to the right place. Oh, don't touch me. Don't touch me, my friend. Be my friend. Oh no, he doesn't want to be my friend. He doesn't want to be my friend. He doesn't want to be my friend. This is this. Oh my god. Okay. Well, welcome to the actual hub, which is actually kind of cool uh, because this is what you guys are gonna see. So there, there you go. Uh, there's a sheep that's named Jeb that's changing colors. That's also awesome. So, uh, yeah, it was actually not at all what I wanted planned. Uh, but you know what? Could have been a lot worse. So let's uh, let's actually jump down and get started. I could actually just... You guys should totally go through the tutorial. It's actually really simple and really important to read. Uh, but we're just going to go Warp Job Center. Because I've already read it, and I'm not going to bore you guys with that. If you want to read the tutorial, you guys can do that on the server. Uh, you do have to go through it at least once, I believe. Uh, but we're here back. Okay, so... We're here, we're good, we're ready to go. Um, so pretty much what we're going to do is the start off is actually very similar to prisons. Funny enough, we mine all sorts of resources and we're going to sell to do all of our rank ups. So now we're going to do a rank up list. 
And there are ranks. So see, there's only eight of them. Now they do progress really like, I, I want to say slow, but they're huge progressions. So right now we're a hobo. Well, Rob-a-dob-flob doesn't have a job yet. <laughs> we're, we're, we're working on it. We're working on it, guys. So for now, rob a flob doesn't have a job, but we're going to try to become a citizen, and then we're going to be a worker. So that's what we need because we don't have a job technically until we're a worker. Uh, the main thing we want is a manager because at manager, you can start opening up your own stores, and that's awesome. So that way, you can like I can buy things and then sell them for like higher prices because they're you know they're just goodness. So we're going to work on getting $1,000 today, maybe even getting like $5,000. That would be amazing. So let's see what we can do. Now here, what can we do as a hobo? Well, we can go to the dirt pit, the stone mine, and the lumber mill. So that's that's kind of, that's great. Uh, and I think we can do kit iron to get ourselves fully kitted in some iron stuff. We're going to move away this sword because we don't really need it for now. Like, you just saw that PvP area, but that's not really where we're going to be spending a lot of our time. It's going to be more about mining now there is a wilderness kind of like factions which is really cool uh where you actually will be able to fight pvp and, like have your own things and stuff and that's where we're gonna have our towns and like our homes and stuff and uh it should be really cool let me just mine this stuff real quick uh there's a lot of people here let's just get out of the way i'm, I'm probably gonna actually fill my inventory real quick and just do a whole bunch of mining off camera because you know that's how i like to do and then when i get back we'll be hopefully with a little bit of money i guess or i at least can you know do a little bit of talking or i'll show you guys the three different places the hobo can come to and we'll see i'll probably do a stack of each and see which one gives me more money which one takes more time and uh, we'll be right back in just a second but yeah there's some really cool stuff in this i'm really excited uh before i do this dip now now's the time to go into the comment section below and tell me what you guys want to see in the next episode what you guys want me to tackle a little tips and tricks i really would appreciate it so let's jump right in i'll be right back in just a second all right so we're making a little bit of a trap i'm wondering if i can grab anyone here where uh i put only a one block at the top here and then if they fall down they're gonna die uh if you guys remember i did fall for this trap once before and we're gonna see if we can make this happen uh, on this end here maybe someone will fall down here and die there's a lot of people up there all they gotta do is mine out. do you want to maybe make it like too big um like too wide that'd be kind of cool and let's go ahead and do that and i will go ahead and see if something crazy happens who knows who knows maybe someone will fall down and die Oh, 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 now this might be eco survival where you think just making money is okay, but nah, now you're asking yourself, why did Wolfos go to prison? Maybe this is why, because in another life, I'm just a crazy man. I'm a crazy man with crazy plans, and I want to, I want to do things the dirt away. Um, but I'll let you guys know if something falls. If not, I'm going to continue mining. Should be a lot of fun, and uh, we'll be right back. Alright, so I did a little bit of mining, no one fell for my trap, and I want to test something. I don't- oh no, they reset! Oh darn it. I don't even know if uh, fall damage exists, I haven't checked that yet, but uh, don't fall down the trap either way, not even close. Which is very sad, but I did fill my inventory with stuff. You can tell I didn't get more wood than anything because I find gathering wood to be therapeutic. Maybe that's because I'm a Canadian and, and I don't know, I'm like a lumberjack. I'm a lumberjack and that's okay. I, I don't know the words. I'm sorry, I don't know the words. I break a wood all day. We're gonna make it up. Cause I'm a lumberjack and I don't care what you say. Woo! Uh, okay, so fall damage. Um, so we, we broke it all up. We got it all rocking and rolling. And uh, we're gonna see how much we could sell everything for. And kind of get a feel of what we want to spend the majority of our time on. $24 for a stack of cobblestone. Uh, $12 for a stack of dirt. And that makes sense. I would say you mine dirt twice as fast as you do cobblestone. Um, and then we have, let's might as well sell what we have. So boom, boom, and a boom, and a boom. Fantastic. And then boom, 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 boom. And there we go. Okay. So, uh, actually we sell a couple of those. Keep on going, keep on going. Dollar fifty for the win. Uh, it's actually every four cobblestone. That's, that's awesome. So, 64 cobbles for $24, but I think that wood actually seems to be uh, the biggest thing to sell. And I know it takes a little bit more time to mine, but I don't think it takes that much more time to mine. Because if we come all the way over here, and I don't know why anyone would not mine it. Uh, if we come over here and we buy, you have to make it logs into planks, $24 for 64 wood. But planks, that means that cobblestone would need to take four times longer to mine than wood time to do some mathematics right now let's let's break out the mining 
speeds Minecraft. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and figure this out and be right back and see if it actually takes four times the speed to mine uh, these bad boys. So we'll be right back after I do mathematical equations. It's very intense, like Albert Einstein style. All right, with a little bit of research, I found out that it takes 0.4 seconds to mine stone with your pickaxe, while it takes 0.5 seconds to mine it with, uh, to mine wood with an axe. So if we go ahead and take this down, now if you remember, I sold pretty much two stacks of cobblestone for $24 each, and it took me about the same time, technically, to mine it. Uh, if we go now and make these into planks, we have a lot more to sell. We are going to make a lot more money than if we're doing the uh, the stone. So it looks like that's what I'm going to be using to make this. It actually won't take long at all. All to get our balance up every time we basically mine uh, a stack of uh, a, a stack of what you call a stack of wood we're getting pretty much a hundred dollars so we pretty much need to do that ten times I need to get ten well I, we, we already have three hundred and fifty dollars so I really only have to do it seven more times I need seven more stacks of wood and we're gonna be pretty much ready to already progress to the next level we're gonna get a hobo pretty quick we chop it down with trees like it's no big deal. So I'm going to go ahead and do this. Uh, probably going to break this pit. That's the issue is I'm going to break this axe because it's running low on durability. I don't think it can actually handle the amount of wood. So we're not really sure what to do next. It's going to be kind of sketchy. Maybe we can find somewhere to make it. It's going to be uh, interesting because I am a homo and I don't have a home. So I'm going to have to figure that out. We're going to run the, into that problem when we get there. And it's probably going to happen pretty soon. Uh, I'm a little bit afraid, honestly. But, uh-oh, we'll, uh, we'll, we'll, we'll cross that bridge when we get there. Wish me luck. Okay, so I, I just broke my pickaxe and didn't get very far. Uh, but, uh, thankfully I have slash kit now. Uh, I did use the diamond kit, uh, like a day or two ago when I was just playing around on the server, so I don't have access to it anymore. I think uh, it's uh, like only once a week. So we actually can't get that nice diamond pickaxe that that Zondus guy has. Maybe we can touch his body and maybe get it. Oh, okay. He's got a job. Zondus, Zondus has got a job at Zondus. So we're going to actually have to use uh, Kit Gold uh, and use gold stuff. We'll put on the crown because now we have options and we could use his golden axe. But this is not going to last long. This is, oh my god. It breaks it really quick. I did not know that the mining time for gold is that fast. But look at how quickly that is disintegrating. Oh man, we're barely gonna get a stack of wood out of this. All right, well, let's mine it up, use it up. Okay, yep, there we go. And pop. And what other kits do we have? Uh, kit food, kit XP, kit potions. Oh, 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 oh. Um, all right, so this is kind of sketchy. I think this is where we're gonna actually have to make investments. We have $376, um, and I think we can maybe buy iron somewhere there's got to be a shop at some point here um that would be an interesting way to do it maybe we can actually get diamond for that much i wonder how much it's going to cost to get three diamond um let's go look at some shops see if we can find something here uh, head back into this area because i do know that there are those lovely lovely pickaxes over here axe how much is this thing one stone axe for ten dollars all right how quickly does this try warp market our uh, warp player market, which we're gonna do. Uh, that's where we're probably gonna get a good purchase, but let's just go see how quickly we go through the stone axe, how fast it chops down this bad boy slash eat. Uh, how fast it chops down this, uh, these trees, these big square trees. All right, so let's go and, oh man, that's pretty laborious. I'm not gonna lie, but that's also breaking really quick. So I'm gonna have to go through this entire ax and still not have enough money for $1,000, I don't think, uh, by going through this entire stone pick, uh, stone ax. So let me go ahead and do that because this is this is laborious. This is insane. This is gonna take forever. I'm gonna go put some funk and psychedelic music on probably and jam out. Jam it out like crazy, um, and then uh, be right back in just a second when this is broken. <gasps> oh my god, this is gonna it's gonna be a long time. Actually, we're gonna go super, let's go super, let's go super fast mode. You guys get to see me go uh, in circles. It should be fun. Okay, <gasps> let's go.
we, we got a whole bunch of wood, but again, not nearly enough. Uh, so we went to the player market. So welcome to the player market. You need to be a manager or hire to create shops. You can be any rank to buy from the shops. Do not rent more than one stall at a time. Um, so this is pretty cool. There's a shop guard here hanging out. So hey, hey, dude, you look really, you look really scary. I don't not want to mess with you. So let's see what uh, what people have to sell here. So redstone, wood, buy thirty two for one hundred and fifty dollars. Why does that not seem legit? Um, XP bottle, blaze rod, diamond pickaxe. Uh, does this guy have diamond axe? He does. Ninety five dollars. I will buy you. The shop is out of stock. All right, so we're going to do a little bit of exploring then. Look at this place. Wow, that's awesome. Look at these open stalls, though, guys. These got to get filled here. Rent $2,000 <gasps> for two plus days. That is crazy. Oh, man. Look at all the room there is, though. That's that's the great thing uh, that I was really happy to see is that there's a lot of room for growth on the server. A lot of room for jobs to buy. So I, I look forward to playing with you guys. Uh, we are working on a bigger assortment. Okay, well, you guys keep on working on that. So what do we got here? Gold ingot, gold block. Uh, let's see here. Raw fish. Gas tier. Diamond block for... What is that? $550. Uh, iron block for $525. One diamond is $55. So for $150, or a little bit more, um, hmm, that is going to be probably worth it because... Is that, a, is that a one block of diamond for $60? Um, oh, boy. It doesn't look like any other shops will carry what I'm looking for. Ooh, potions. That's pretty awesome. So we're going to have to go ahead and just buy those diamonds, um, which is a little sad. Makes me a little sad. So let's let's do that. You know, let's just check out the warp market first, uh, just the, the non-player owned ones, and see what we get uh, and see what the prices are really there. Yeah, for cheaper prices. So let's see what sort of prices we got here. Uh, for the actual market um, looking for diamond pickaxe if it's hundred and fifty dollars I'm buying it <laughs> I'm 100% buying it that is a good deal because I am have to buy three diamonds from them um, so that's that's not gonna be fun uh, I mean, well, it'll be fun but it's still gonna be like hundred and sixty five dollars so so no thank you um, all right a second here. Let's let's see redstone random things armor food resources and tools up here second floor All right uh, food and we want resources and tools. Okay diamond eighty dollars For a diamond. Oh my god, and the iron axe is only eighty dollars and Two hundred and forty dollars. Okay, so we're gonna go back to warp player market This is totally worth it. Uh, we're also gonna slash eat uh, because our appetite is required to be satiated. Uh, we're going to head over to this place and we're going to buy that diamond. Uh, one diamond for $55. You can't buy here. Is that because I'm a hobo? Is is this is this hoboism? I think this hoboism. Gosh darn it. Alright, so that kind of sucks. Uh, not going to lie. Uh, let's just go ahead and buy the diamond pickaxe in this place. Or absolute rip. This is this is capitalism for you. It's just I can't buy somewhere and then make me buy somewhere else. And it's just it's a whole lot of sad. It's a whole lot of sad. Uh, probably could you just buy the iron. If we buy two iron picks, it's only going to be $160. Um, but you know what? We're going to go for the worthy investment. We're going to get a diamond axe. Um... I think that's a good call. Let's just see how quickly this eats through things, and I think we could definitely make a thousand dollars easy, um, really soon. Like probably in the next five minutes. So I just want to—I want you guys to witness the difference, the power, the intensity that is this diamond axe. Because uh, well, I don't really want to uh, do anything else but what I mean. We could just mine cobblestone. It wouldn't be the biggest deal, but I just feel like it's four times longer uh, than as uh, if we were actually go with the diamond here. And look, we got a nice oh. Ooh, hello everybody. Uh, I was like, we have a nice little roof to work with, and then I fell off. The sadness is real, everyone. The sadness is real. Okay, so we're gonna jump on up here and get to go. So do a little bit of mine. Let's just see how fast this is. Wow, so worth it. Oh, that's so quick. Pew, 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 pew. This is so quick. I'm going to absolutely fill up in like three seconds. It's gonna be awesome. All right, so we're gonna do a little bit of a cut. We'll be right back when we have all this done. This is not gonna take long. I'll see you guys in just a second. Hold on, spicy. If this isn't friendship, I don't know what is. Me and him, we're just, we're just mining up this. What me and Zondas, 
Just together. Together forever. I love it. I'm actually going to finish up this one stack. And Oh, Zondas, I got to come next to you, buddy. We got to be friends. Friends till the end. Me and Zondas mining wood. Yeah, baby, look at us go. I feel like we're in love. Zondas, come with me. Zondas, mine with me, baby. Zondas. Um, <laughs> oh, God. He has no idea. He has no idea. He just doesn't know. He's not stupid tomorrow enough to be my friend. Zondas, we're going to complete it together. Yay, Zondas. Yay. Uh, he's got a job. All right, let's go. Let's go sell. I think we're going to break a thousand if my mathematical skills are correct. Um, I need I need an ender chest slash E chest. Um, oh God, wait 2,777 hours before command E chest is warmed up. You make me sad. You make me very, very sad. All right, so let's go ahead and pew, and then we're gonna go pew, and then we're gonna go a pew, and a pew, and holy moly, we got so much wood, and then we're gonna just sell, 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 sell. Sell, 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 sell. Oh, this is tough work, guys. I don't think rub it up flop can get a job. I just don't think I can do it. I'm sorry. I need to go. This is just not working out for me. I don't get a job. I can't. I just, you know what? Nope, 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 nope. You know what? My new job is circling this lamppost forever. Rub a dub flop. Now it's a job. I'm pretty I'm pretty good at it too. Look at me go. Oh, I'm even getting centered. <laughs> oh my god. Uh no, we're going to we're going to keep on going. We're going to keep on going. And uh, you've insufficient wood. Not the first time I've heard that before. Slash balance. Oh, we're only halfway there. <gasps> oh my goodness. But with the uh with the the axe, it's uh it's actually going really smooth. Just go ahead and sell all this bad boy stuff, get out of here, get out of the inventory. Um so that's not bad, $726. Uh, pretty awesome. We're not gonna have to do this for much longer. We'll go ahead and get uh, $1,000 and progress to the next level. Um, I really will most likely be, uh, my, my goal is to progress one rank every level, uh, just to give you guys an idea. That's like, that's my goal for each one. I don't know what it's gonna take. Sometimes maybe I had to record and live stream for two hours to get to that point, but that is my goal. So we have, like I said, rank up list. Uh, we have eight. Now, I, I will do more than eight episodes for sure, but there is a lot more to do once you get to the higher levels. But at least I would, I want to get uh, one, one dude and duders every single episode. So that's my goal. So uh, maybe if you guys jump on the server and help me out when I get my shop, you guys can like donate me money. But I'm trying to be doing this. Like the only reason I have, uh, I do have VIP by the way, guys. You can tell by when I say goodness in the chat. You can see that it says VIP next to my name, but I don't really think that, that really gives me much or not things that I'm using. I'm literally just using it for slash eat, by the way. So when you do, when you see me slash eat, that's that's what I get. Uh, that's how I do it. That's how I hack. Cause I'm a hacker. Yo, dog. <laughs> um, all right. Oh, so they're all freaking out. I'm, I just randomly said goodness, and they, they, they don't know what is going on. Uh, I am <laughs> Rob Hadob. Uh, rub a dub flob doesn't have a job. <laughs> I'm just a, a meager little hobo. That's all I am. <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna go mine a whole bunch and. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> um, I'm gonna go and, and, and just do a little bit of mining, guys, and uh, I'll be right back. You guys know how it is. We're gonna go do a little bit of a ding, little, little thing that I'll do. And, uh, <laughs> uh, who's Wuffles? Oh my god, what in, the, what in the world? Oh my god, what? What is that? I'm out of here. I don't like it. I don't like it. It's a, it's a coward. It's freaking me out. Oh my god. What is, what's wrong with it? Are you okay, cow? Oh my god! I'm so scared right now. I'm so scared. I want to kill it. I want to kill it. Oh! It was, it was a magician. Is that the magician? Is he stalking me? How dare he? Anyways, alright, so I'll be right back. Just We're going to go ahead and do a little bit of a cuddy duddy and uh, a cuddy duddy. And we'll be right back when I got uh, enough money to rock and roll. Actually, probably it'll be like one more thing. So it should be only 30 seconds, though. So hopefully, we're back. Just think. Okay. All right, so I just did a whole bunch of selling. It's actually raining. Let's get in our little hut here, and uh, I'm pretty much there. I have like $922, so I need to get uh, three more 
three more stacks of wood, which uh, should not take a long time. Pretty much grab, uh, we got 20 here, so that is almost enough. Uh, and we're gonna be ready to go, ready to progress, ready to rock and roll. Look at our wood cutting level 39. Actually, I, I don't know what that does in MCMMO levels. I don't do a lot of wood cutting. I have not cut the wood a lot. Uh, so I don't think I cut faster and if I right click I just ready my axe and I think that just gives me superpowers But I cannot unlock them yet. I'm like spider-man and I'm going through my trepidations and trying to figure out how to shoot out my web And uh, I'm unfortunately not as smart as Peter Parker at least in the amazing Spider spider-man. He's, he's smart and he has to make that contraption um, So I can't I just I can't I just can't and okay. Well, yeah, see that's what happens We just kind of zone out for a little bit and we definitely have enough we are going to have a thousand dollars. And balance. And oh, someone gave me money. Someone gave me twenty thousand dollars. I am so scared. Well, we're gonna we're gonna rank up. We're definitely gonna have enough to, to do that. We're now citizen. Uh, rank up list. Uh, let's see here. So we actually probably have enough to make a worker. So maybe we'll actually get a job in, in, in the next episode. The question is, do I use the money that has been given to me? Hmm. That's a good one. Uh, you guys let me know in the comments. You guys get to decide my fate. Uh, if I see more comments saying, Here's the money, here's the money. Robert a flob will get a job in the next episode by getting a worker. If you guys say, don't use the money, I will give it away to a random person on the server and then Robert a flob will not have the money. And then I'm going to have to work hard, very, very hard, to simply become a citizen. I mean a worker, which is $5,000. Uh, which, I don't know how long it's going to take. So anyways, that's going to be the episode, guys. Again, if you guys want to continue this series, make sure you let me know by hitting that like button and checking out the server for sure. Come on, play with me. Come on, hang out. I'm definitely going to need some help now in the future building up a town, building up a village. So hop on. I'm giving you guys a chance to, to do it alongside with me here. And that's the whole point. So the next episode will probably be out in a couple days. Uh, so you guys have some time to catch up, uh, to play, to maybe progress a little bit farther. But don't go too far because we're going to play this together, guys. It should be a lot of fun. And I'll see you guys later. Take care. And I'm gonna get a job. Oh, yeah.